Right now everybody, welcome back to the channel, welcome back to another video, I hope you are all well. Before we get into today's vlog, remember to subscribe to the channel if you're not already and like the videos if you are enjoying them. But yeah, it is Friday, it is 10 to 7, so it is quite late, I have been at my mum and dad's pretty much all of today. I had my driving lesson and then went there, went... Yeah, so we went there and then just chilled there. Edited the video that went out yesterday. Like tonight, Friday, as you're watching this. And then, yeah, just came, came, came picked us up around about half five. No, finished work at half five, picked us up around about six. And we've just been back chilling. And um, had a few little nibbles before Kate decided what she wanted. For tea, I had a McDonald's for dinner because I'd had nothing to eat all day and then got to mine and was like, I felt like I was about to pass out and I didn't know what was in the house to eat at my mum and dad's because I felt, for the first time ever, felt a little bit rude just going in and like raiding the cupboards so I was like, I'll buy me own food. So, Katie felt like I cheated on her so she's now getting a McDonald's which is immature if I do say so myself but... <laughs> wow. Um, but yeah, we had a few parcels yesterday. I can't remember if I showed them in the vlog or not, but that was the cushion that came. It is currently obviously being sat on. Um, we are still waiting on one more. There was a parcel that was delivered to a neighbour. I don't think it'll be the other pillow that we're waiting on though. Because was that one just posted, can you remember, yesterday? Yeah. yeah, so as for me for tea, I'm not really that hungry after my McDonald's, so I'm probably just going to have some cereal in like a couple of hours time. Um, but yeah, apart from that, I hope you are well and there's not really going to be much happening tonight to be honest, we're just going to pretty much chill out. I, had, I think I've got some comments that I'll just probably read over on the vlog. And is that? What? I just can't find the remote anywhere. Oh, it's on the yeah, it's on there. But yeah, I've got a few comments. Sorry about that. I've got a few comments to sort of go over. There's nothing like major, but I just like reading them out on here so you guys see what's being said. And yeah, apart from that, probably do some clothes shopping of some sort later just have a little look around online at some bits and bobs maybe show you that there was something for the house that i wanted to look for as well and like do that and show you but i can't quite remember right now so i will show you that if i do remember but yeah apart from that i will pick you back up in a second Right everyone, I am out of the shower now, all freshly hair washed and washed myself. Um, just been talking there about the garden, but first, Katie has just had a parcel through the door and it's not another Christmas present for me, so I don't really care, but... Goo and a tent... Do you not remember us talking about this? No. To get rid of the stuff from the vinyl. The sticky oh, is that that? Yeah. Oh, that's good. Oh, that's quite cool. So that's for the. Um, it's like this. The, I don't know what there's it like is. a sticky. It was when, when he was. He was laying, yeah, he was laying the vinyl, and what he was doing was like he was spraying this stuff to get it laid. To get it laid. <laughs> to get it to stick to the floor. And then, but like he must have like there. sprayed over the top once that he stuck it down. Or it was just like left over uh -huh. somewhere. And it had just sort of, almost just like seeped through a little mm -hmm. gap and but yeah. it's basically just made this really sticky like patches hasn't yeah. it on the on the vinyl and it's like we've we scrubbed and scrubbed in when yeah, we, we started, started ripping the colour yeah the colour and the like the edges and stuff would sort of start raising a bit more like as if we were ripping it away if we were going too aggressive so we sort of stopped that and we thought it would go away with time. Yeah, but walking it's... Walking on it and stuff, and it hasn't. But then I found this on, on Amazon. Goo gone. Goo gone. And it's supposed to be really good. And it's a pen adhesive remover. 
remover. Only on stuff. Amazon. Gum, tree sap, glue, stickers and ad adhesive, goo. It's goo. Oh no, it was gum. <laughs> Candle wax, crayons and tape. So hopefully that does the trick. But anyways, hopefully. back to the gum. Was that all that came as well in that yeah, box? That was that box. It is crazy like the size of boxes that come yeah. and it's just like I something so that small like that. Do you know how they have like obviously the return yeah. address on stuff? I tend to like gauge where it's from based on that. Yeah. And I was like, I don't understand where this is from. Where did it say? Sense. David Laid, was it? Something. Uh, David Laid, why? That's like, somewhat uh, famous, I feel like. David John Papers Limited. David John Papers Limited. But then, what the yeah. hell have I ordered from David John Papers Limited? But, anyways, back to the <laughs> garden. We, Katie's ordered some like sample slabs that I will pop on the screen just around my face now once Katie sends us them because I haven't even seen them myself. Um, but yeah, so we are with the garden gonna go out and sort of measure where we want the slabs to go up to. And then when we decide on which slabs we want, we're gonna get someone out that we want to fit them to just quickly measure to make sure that we've got our measurements right because that's probably just the safest thing to do it saves a lot of money oh you not had your advent calendar? no Shit. Yeah. yeah oh I forgot you had yeah. two mm -hmm. your hero's one obviously comes in individual yeah. packets on the table you have to work on the morning whereas this one it's, it's just the chocolate. individual chocolate and then I'll brush my teeth and come down and do it, so yeah. I this one So, I will, like I say, I've, I will have already popped them on the screen, I might again, just for good effect, but yeah, so we're gonna potentially measure that sooner rather than later, and um, have a look at some. So you've ordered some, haven't you? And then your yeah. dad has a brochure yeah. that you're gonna pick up tomorrow, so we'll have a look through them tomorrow and show you some from the brochure that we'll see that we like. And yeah, that's because like I say, the, the next thing that we are going to work on a lot next year is going to be the garden. I think from sort of April onwards, when the weather gets a lot more drier, we'll look at getting that the paving done first, and then the decking at the back, and then we not next year, but the year after, so 2023. Yes, we will probably get the app. I want to say AstroTurf again, but it's the, just like the artificial grass on like in like the middle of the paving and the decking. But next year we will probably just seed it, just because to be honest, we'll probably get the paving then and then. Seed. I thought we would do the decking just so then we know that gap. I thought that would be easy, just because then as well yeah, with the decking nice. they would just be treading all over True. the grass. Yeah. I suppose I wasn't sure if we would have enough money to go straight to. No, but like as in just get it oh, like measured it out, and then because be, uh, I think with to, with Deck and June just no. order all the stuff anyways and then yeah you just order all the timber and then someone will come and do it for us. Do it, but I think we've got family that can do. Yeah. So we'll save money there. We'll have to pay for the timber and the um and the stain. Yeah. Hopefully, anyways, hopefully. Hopefully. and then. But we'll do the deck and, and then it'll probably be, to be honest, by that time, I don't honestly say close to winter again. And we'll have to quickly get just some seeding down. Yeah, we're quite, well, I think we're quite fortunate, but it's quite lucky that the seeding season yeah. ends in October. October, so, so it can be so quite we could, late. We could push it quite late, like yeah. right to the barrier of when you can and when you can't. Yeah, so it. we'll do that and then yeah, then the garden will be pretty much... No garden furniture next year, though, I guess. No, because it'll be like, like say, though, it'll be like the end of it'll summer, definitely, by the time it's all down and done, so it's... Yeah, it'll be 2023. There'll be no point of spending money on... Get it all in the, properly. And having, like, garden parties like, and stuff like that and getting in. people in the garden. So, to be honest, 2023, we might not even get the fake grass. We might just go like that, just have a summer of actually enjoying the garden. What we've got. Because... Cutting the grass isn't actually that bad. I think it's bad on, I don't, I would rather do it out there than the front, but I don't know why, but the front is just irritating to cut. Like I, I think it's because you know you've kind of got to cut it because that's the 
the visual of the house like everyone sort of sees it so it's like if you, it's like an awkward shape as well, yeah and i think that would literally be one long strip yeah and like you say we've seen you've seen us have to sort of dig down the bottom and get stone and put down because it was on a slope so yeah. whereas that wouldn't really matter yeah. that way that but that. yeah so that's that all talked about uh we did have a few comments i think there was two people said that they liked sweet curry and one said sweet sweet and sour and then one person said that they like curry although sweet curry from mcdonald's is unbelievable speaking of mcdonald's how was your mcdonald's very nice katie had a little tiktok combo of chicken mayo and double cheeseburger very nice and yeah so I'm going to have some cereal now, it is like 10 past 9, I did just ask my mum where the massage gun was and it's still at her house so I'm a bit good that I've not brought that home. Um, but yeah, I hope you're all well and if you have any other questions about sort of ideas and stuff that we want to do with the house just let us know, like well ask them in the comments, I don't mind sort of sharing what our plans for certain rooms or things outside like um the garage as well want to turn that into a bit of a utility area and yeah just all of that sort of stuff but for now i'm going to get my cereal and i'll catch you in a second right everyone so i've just had my cereal and in that last clip i forgot to mention just like quick thank you for the comments um on not the last video i think the video before so what would that have been Thursday Thursday night's video just sort of oh, yeah I'd, Wednesday or Thursday's video and um, just basically saying sort of how well we they're doing and what, like me and Katie are doing they're doing as if it's someone else but like with the house and stuff and yeah just nice comments to read and a lot of stories about other people sort of moving into their houses and stuff so I hope it all goes well for you guys and use it's just all nice and smooth for you it wasn't for me and katie but i think the thing that looking back that i wish i sort of just always had in the back of my mind is that it sort of doesn't last forever like if it something goes wrong it, it gets fixed and you're, it's you're gonna like just think of like a month's time and you pro more than likely will be in the house i mean we had like the leak the floor an issue I think many other issues just off the top of my head. They're the two like main the ones, main ones that I thought. Wi-Fi. Yeah, the Wi-Fi. But that's not like how you say that to me. I think, I think um, people have just moved in just up the street and their Wi-Fi I'm sure is already sorted because I've seen open reach vans outside of there for the last mm -hmm. three days. So yeah, but like I remember when we first threw the leak, that was literally like day two or three, wasn't it? And we were like, oh my god, the house is gonna come crumbling down. And then someone came and went, oh no, it's just because it's the the it sinks moved. Time, it was just it had moved, it had moved, and it had just died. Like it slackened one of the somethings, and meant water would just come out. Yeah. So yeah, thank you for them comments and all that good stuff. And for today, that is going to be it. So I hope you have enjoyed. Remember to subscribe to the channel if you're not already. And like the videos if you are enjoying them. I'm enjoying making these daily videos. And just, to be honest, I don't know. Like, I always felt like I, could, I wouldn't get back into doing daily stuff. Because of how sort of time consuming it was. And I didn't always think that there was going to be stuff to talk about. Some days there isn't, like, um, Friday night's vlog. Like, there wasn't actually much to talk about. Tonight's vlog, even to an extent, has been very little to talk about. But if you just go into depth about it and stuff like that, I know people love that, then it turns out there is. So, yeah, subscribe if you are enjoying the channel and you're not already subscribed. Like the videos if you are enjoying them, and I'll catch you tomorrow.